The National Center for Atmospheric Research, or NCAR, is a group of scientists that research the atmosphere and earth system science. And they do this research in collaboration with member universities that are managed by UCAR, which is the University Corporation for Atmospheric Research. In addition to collaborating with scientists from the member universities, NCAR also has facilities for research that can be used by this consortium of universities. So that means that scientists from both NCAR and the universities can use our research aircraft, our ground-based uh, monitoring systems, and our supercomputing system. Our team has experience creating educational resources for both use in the classroom and in online settings. We also create and facilitate live virtual programs and in-person programs that are hosted at our facility here at the NCAR Mesa Lab in Boulder, Colorado. When teachers use the resources that we share, students are getting access to information that connects to real world science and is giving them a chance to explore how our world works and make those connections to their everyday lives. The UCAR Center for Science Education helps students learn about Earth System Science by presenting the authentic science that people do, but in a way that's engaging and accessible to them with common materials that they're familiar with, and we have fun doing that. So my favorite thing to teach the students or show them is something to do with the air, the way it expands and contracts, or it could be something as simple as taking a little empty bottle and dipping the top of it into some soapy water, and then letting them actually put the bottle into a tub of hot water and into a tub of cold water, and watching that bubble expand and then contract right there in front of them so they get to actually do the science themselves. The UCAR Center for Science Education helps teachers by giving them the tools that they're not going to find in other places. We're good at finding out what can be helpful and providing it to them in a way that they can access and then um, present to their students. The UCAR Center for Science Education works to inspire and engage and inform students and teachers and the public about the atmospheric and earth system science being done here at the National Center for Atmospheric Research as well as our member universities. So what that means for us is that we deliver programs, we design exhibits that could be in-person uh, programs or virtual programs, as well as a lot of teacher resources on our website. And the great thing is all of that is free. <laughs> So I think what's unique about the UCAR Center for Science Education and the programs that we're providing is that we get to work closely with the Earth System scientists themselves. So we have our world-class team here developing and designing our programs, but then all of that we work closely with the atmospheric and Earth System scientists themselves who are involved in the process as well. So the programs that we're delivering really are based in authentic science. They're aligned with NGSS standards. They're aligned with best practices in education, uh, but we also are really rooted in that real active science going on and really current science that's happening. It's a really unique experience. So you can have your students connect and be fully interactive with one of our science education specialists here at UCAR. Uh, you can connect with scientists and researchers, engineers, computer programmers through our programs, no matter where you are. So we come to you in your classroom. You don't have to leave the classroom to go on a field trip. Uh, you can book one of our programs for free and have a really unique experience that's gonna be hands-on and fun and engaging and based in authentic science for your kids. We were all super excited to come and see what they have to show us here and what, what the scientists are doing and what, what we can learn here. They do an amazing job explaining, but not telling too much, asking questions and letting the kids discover on their own. It's innovative because there's so much hands-on experience for the kids. When we design programs for students, we're mostly looking at how to tell the story of Earth System Science, how to make that accessible for learners of all ages. We look to, as much as possible, integrate actual scientific data into the activities that students are exploring. We base all of our instructional materials off of, off of the next generation science standards and we include, whenever possible, um, interactives and um, visuals and graphs and things like that to analyze as well. We just launched our Sky Sci for Kids website, which is geared towards learners that are under the age of six. So that helps um, youth that are not quite reading as much or are able to analyze all of the data as much to learn about these Earth system science concepts. 
We also tailor different lessons and activities to specific age groups. So we chunk them by being lower elementary, upper elementary, middle school, or high school. It feels great to wake up each day knowing that the work we do is addressing important challenges that our society faces and that we're helping people ask questions and learn about how the world works so that they can contribute to a positive new world.